you say the Father and the Son and the Holy Ghost, a Father is a person. A Son is a person from Father. A Holy Ghost is an invisible person, which we cannot see, like a spirit. So how can a Father, a Son and the Holy Ghost can become one? Your husband, your son and your father cannot become one. So this is a nonsensical belief more than 4,000 years before and even many thousand years before this was practiced by the pagan culture to believe about many gods. They believe the sun, as we will, is a god. The Baal, the Horus, the Othello, even the Scandinavian, they had their gods long before Christianity. So they had their myths, the one god is like a snake, is rounding all over the earth and making a black hole and all this one god kill another god, another god win the race. This is their myths. There are Hindu beliefs the same way the Hindu beliefs. That God Almighty, He has many forms. 33, 330 million forms. So, this is, this is not to be found anywhere. Isa was very clear, straightforward. And according to the Christian's authority, the scholars, they say Trinity is not to be found in any of the early scriptures, the Greek and the Hebrew manuscript. So, they throw this part of Trinity from the Bible. And they are coming closer to Islam. Allah says, don't say Trinity, so they left out Trinity. So this is, this is what is the record. If you can go back to the past history, this was the practice by the pagan culture. The Greek and the Romans, they practiced these three gods. And somehow the others, the Christians, they adopted it. And now they put forward inside their book, and they say to the Father, Son, and Holy Ghost, these three are one. There are verse in the Bible, in the first epistle of John, chapter 5, verse 7, in the Red Letter Bible it says, for there are three that bear records in heaven, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost, and these three are one. The closest verse refers to Trinity is this verse. First Epistle of John, chapter 5, verse 7. But the word Trinity is nowhere in the Bible. This is the Christians, they say Trinity. We have to believe in Trinity. Our God is triune God. They invented many new words, millennium. Now this is their invention. Nowhere this word to be found in the Bible and Quran condemned to say God is in triumph form. But this was many years before Christianity was practiced in the Greeks and the Roman culture. I hope I give the answer. Yes. I think your question is finished. Yes, sister. Raised, uh, was she raised in a mosque-like mosque -like place or to the cluster? You know, Maryam Alayhi Salaam. Uh, Maryam Alayhi Salaam. Yeah, how, where was she raised as a child and grown up? Uh -huh. The sister asked the question that what, where did uh, Mother Mary, peace be upon her, so was grown up? As it was uh, being a story recorded in the Bible, as per the Bible, that Zachariah, Zachariah, he was praising to God Almighty to give him a child so that he can give them in the temple service. But there is no such a mention. The Quran says the Maryam a.s. was the ancestor of Yaupa Haruna of Harun a.s. such a noble ancestry, the descendant of Harun a.s. And then one of the certain time Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala sent the, uh, the message to him through Archangel Jibreel a.s. that uh, yeah, that O Mary, Allah has chosen thee and purified thee and chosen thee above the women of all nations. And then the story goes ahead. She was brought up in the house of Zachariah. And that is recorded as the Christian's Bible. Since the Quran doesn't contradict it, so we say we can refer to as what it is. So that's how she was brought up. And... Later on, she was also, she was meant by her mother to be in the temple service. So Zachariah won the toss and she took the responsibility of uh, Mother Mary because they were playing in the coin who will take the responsibility of the child and the story goes uh, quite further. The Quran gives an indication that Zalika min bai lai binuhi ilayka. Allah says in Quran Surah Imran chapter 3 verse 45. The Prophet Muhammad Islam, you are not there when they play with the coins. That who will take the responsibility of the child? But it turns into Zachariah and Hazrat Zachariah, he took the responsibility of Mother Mary and upbringing her. 
I hope I try to answer this question. Yes, Brother, I think you, were, you had a question about the Old and New Testament. <laughs> you can ask. Uh, this brother was asking me the questions uh, during the break that uh, how do we Muslims refer to the Old Testament and New Testament? What is Old Testament? What is New Testament? What is Torah? What is Zubur? And what is Injil? Uh, I, I give some answers with that, uh, the sisters. the criteria to do justice between right and wrong. Yes. So what confirms before, the Quran says it confirms the revelation which came before, which exactly the same as like the Quran. Yes. So as a Muslim, we have no conflicts of accepting Shama Israel or Israel Hainu or Nayakhat. Israel believed that our God is one. We said we all believe the same. This may be the part of God. Not exactly the same, but may, it can be. But the other parts, Israel Islam says, ye are dogs. We cannot believe these are the words because uh, these are the noble prophets and all the prophets occupy high position in the house of Islam. So we say no noble person, sensible person can utter such a word. And the prophet, leave aside the prophet, they were the most righteous person in the world. So this is what you are absolutely right. The commentators uh, in many tafsir, they say, look, we can refer to those words which are similar to the Quran. And we fully agree with that. And the brothers was... Uh, wanted to know about the Bible. So, this Bible actually, this was written some 600 years, some 600 years after the demise of the, uh, uh, after the LS crucifixion of Hazrat There are two parts of the Bible, the Old Testament and the New Testament. The Old Testament are the book of the Jews, and the New Testament are the book of the Christians, including put all new and old together. Old Testament, it describes about all the prophets before Jesus Christ, Hazrat Isa Moses, Abraham, Adam, David, Solomon, Isaiah, all the prophets, peace and blessings be upon them all. This is Torah. Sorry? This is Torah, right? This is not the Torah. They say there are Torah, the five, five books of Moses, this is Torah, and in the you know, book of Psalm, book of Psalm in the Bible, they say this is the book, book of David. Psalm is the book, book was given to David. The Christian and the Jews, they claim this is Torah and this is Zabur and this is Injil. So there are Torah, there are Zabur and there are Injil according to their statements. But when we read through the books, we can find such a things which claim, can claim to be the word of Moses, the word of uh, uh, what you call David or the word of Jesus. This is a red letter Bible. Whatever Isa al was telling, this is in red. Isa al was speaking, this is in red. What he doesn't speak is in black. So which word is this? If this is in Jin, that means what Isa al was giving, this is supposed to be recorded here. And everything should be read. But out of these 27 books of the New Testament, 23, if you read these four books, 23 books out of a red letter or a dash or a doodle. There is no red letter in these 20, in these 24 books. Who wrote this? Certain person called Saint Paul. When he comes in existence, 400 years, 600 years after the demise of Christ, he saw a vision in a dream. And you know, in Friday and Saturday, if you drink a lot, you can dream a lot. So they also write a lot. <laughs> <laughs> And somehow we can we can find proof from inside, and it's a, it's a similar thing. If you see a vision, you see. And I'm sorry to say I don't want to criticize the Christians, but when we read the text, believe me, is uh, how can a sensible man even can write these things? 
So this contradicts the statements even as recorded today in, in red letter. Jesus says, don't break my commandment. Is given him. But St. Paul says, you don't have to practice any of the commandments of Jesus. You just believe he died for your sin and you will be go to heaven. Imagine that how can you believe such a thing that Isa is dying for the sins that we are committing every day. No. No country in the world can have 